How's it going everyone? My name is Michael SK and welcome back to Persona 5 Royal, the new content, the uh, the definitely weird content. A lot of weird stuff's been Please going on, but man, I've been I've been hooked on everything that's been that's been happening. Right now we are out of the palace after our quote unquote initial infiltration, our forced <laughs> initial infiltration, I guess, like like the good old days, if you will. And apparently we need to go to Mementos in order to continue on. Something is blocking our path, and we have to go to Mementos to figure out what that is and deal with it. But before that, I would like to hang out with the majority of our friends, get their personas to rank up, and I also would like to continue hanging out with Sumi because she needs to uh, get that max confidant rank. And I thought, you know, why not check out if anything is different here? Take a look around. It doesn't seem like it. Then again, we don't really need DVDs. I know there's probably still an achievement from the base game that allows you to read all the books, but I don't really care for it. What does Lavenza have so to say? Come. If I may be abrupt, can I ask a favor of you? Oh, okay. Sorry for my dog barking, by the way. That's a thing. The truth is... Oh. I still have memories from when I was split in two, spending time with you and visiting all sorts of places together. So I have been wondering, would you show me your current home? I would like to see the room that has shaped you into the person you have become. <sighs> I do understand my timing is not the most appropriate given the current state of the world, but yeah, why not? I guess it's another hangout session, if you will. Are you certain? Thank you. Yeehaw. At least we won't like get insulted in this one. This is a storage room, yes? But where is your room? Haha. <laughs> well... Oh! I would never have guessed. So you prefer cramped, dingy spaces. How fascinating. I mean, it's not exactly what we prefer here. It's kind of just what we're given. Please, tell me more about yourself. Are we going to jail? Oh, I'm sensing some unusual energy around this desk. Your infiltration tools are made here? Could I possibly try my hand at it? Fuck yeah. Thank you. Let us see what I can do. Bro, can I get something out now, of this? What should I make? Ah, I know. To show my gratitude for rescuing me, I shall craft for you a secret weapon. I think you'll be rather pleased with it. I like how she struggles to get into our school and, you know, continue to manifest hmm. there. This is trickier than I expected. Oh. But like, she's totally fine to come here and create uh -oh. create tools, well, I suppose. I that. Ouch! Cursed screwdriver! How dare you defy your wielder? Well, I, I can see a lot of Carolina Justine in her. Obey me! Drive those screws! Ugh. Oh, screw it! Damn. It seems my time out of body has led to my becoming somewhat undexterous. While it pains me to say it, your secret weapon will have to wait. God damn it. More importantly, I should be using this time to learn more about you. Is this your bed? It's surprisingly similar to the one in your cell. Can you truly rest here? Better than the cell's bunk, it can be a little uncomfortable. It comes with a cat. Yeah, that is true. So you can pet it as much as you like whenever you rest. I must say I am a bit jealous. Still, this space seems somewhat cramped for a fully grown human and a feline. May I sit? Am I going to jail? Optimum firmness. Ideal warmth. I'm not sure why, but I feel so calm here. <sighs> I mean, it is a bed in a bedroom. <sighs> She fell asleep. You fiend. You'll pay for splitting me in two. Let's see how your holy grail holds up to this sledgehammer. Take that. Huh? It didn't work? Seems like she's fighting someone in her dreams. Yeah, I wonder who. Oh, wait. You can't. Uh, no. I'm being split again. Was I talking? Yes. 
You were sleep finding that sounded intense. It did. I have no idea what you're talking about. It was just so comfortable. Perhaps I allowed myself to relax a little too much. I sent some residual energy here as well. Ah, you use it for training. May I ask for a demonstration? Wait, have we actually ever done that in the playthrough? I don't think we have. Come on! One, two! One, two! Put your back into it! You think you can save the world like that? One, two! One, I think two, this is really showing one, us that two, Lavenza one, really isn't two. like... Unlike any other of the Velvet Room don't assistants. Me to go easy on you. I'm doing this for your sake. Like, sure, she's different, but she she is what you would expect out of the uh, assistants in other games. My arms are going to cramp up. And we're dead. Well done. Such commendable willpower. I can sense some lingering energy around this television. Or is it actually coming from the box attached to it? What is this? Yeah, let's uh let's give it a shot. I've only heard of them in stories, but is this one of your world's vaunted video games? Hell yeah. They say that once a player begins, they're unable to tear themselves away. It's that immersion. If it truly can entrance humans to such a degree, could you play a bit for me? I see. You're piloting the spaceship and your objective is to destroy the oncoming enemies. Look how they scatter. This is quite impressive. You weave around each bullet with dizzying precision. Whoa, there's so many of them now. Oh, you're surrounded. Look out, on your right. I mean left. No, they're in front now. Use the boost. Look, it's the boss. Fire the beam cannons. Annihilate it. Where's Morgana? He's better at backseat gaming than her. You did it! The world is saved! <clears throat> A most dexterous display. I can certainly see why humans get so passionate about these games. Perhaps I'll ask my master if we can install one in our room. I think the current Igor would be willing to do that. I've enjoyed glimpse into your daily life. It was quite illuminating. Before I became whole, I visited many places with you and gained a wealth of new experiences. Thanks to that, I feel like I've come to understand humans better. And perhaps more importantly, I feel like I understand you better. So, thank you. Though you have cast off your shackles, I will still await you in that room. This is a token of my gratitude for today. Please, take it. Enduring soul. Wonder what that, uh, what that does. It would be a shame if I were to leave so soon. May I stay a little longer? Oh no. Oh no, we are going to jail. After hanging out for a while longer, I escorted her back to the Velvet Room. That was nice. That was pretty tight. Neat little activity to do. Oh yeah, it's Sunday. Um... Sup. Just something's been on my mind for a while now, actually. Can we talk sometime whenever is good for you? Thanks. Hmm, okay. Yeah, we still gotta hang out with the others. They've been hey, wanting hey. to hang out with us, but, uh, been hanging out with Sumi. Well, then. I don't want to check out the TV. Mm. Futaba's been act- Yeah, I know, we gotta- Gotta go see her. Because today we cannot hang out with her, with Sumi to be exact. So what I actually am gonna do, because I remember last time, um, we, uh, we didn't get all the confidant points that we needed um, for Sumi, so we're gonna go get our fortune told. No matter whose fortune I'm reading, there's nothing but joy and good times ahead. It's almost uncanny. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, let's get a fortune reading. I hate that we what have to pay we for it. We're actually low on funds now. Uh, which one was it? It's not that. But shit, that could be helpful now that I think about it. But this is probably more important. Better results when raising soul. No, not that one. Uh, predict your compatibility with a character to deepen your connection with them. Is that it? 
You can view all a character's confidant abilities. We don't want that. Sends a fusion alarm at Nakura's prison. Don't want that. We want this. Okay. There she is. I saw Maruki in that list. We definitely don't want one with him. That would be kind of pointless. Here we go. So I guess we can go ahead and hang out with Futaba today since she came to go see us. I know that An and Ryuji have talked to us prior. What do you think? I don't know if Yusuke did. I don't think it really matters who we visit first, but, you know, just to get it out of the way. Actually, wait, I saw it highlighted there. Yeah, it's kind of flashing. Haru's does this. So I guess that's just to let us know that it's a team member. We can do something very special. So let's go ahead and do that. We will go to the back streets. Go find uh, Futaba. See what her uh, sphere. Yeah, it's a sphere. The ball could turn into. Oh, hey, can yes, I, I bother you for a sec? Yeah, sure. Why not? There's something I want to talk to you about. It's really important. Hey, hey. This seems serious. What are you gonna do? Yeah, let's do it. I don't like these sad vibes. Can you come a bit later? I'll leave my door open. So just come in. Futaba quickly went home, so what do we do? She should be good now. Yeah, fuck it. We'll just go under that assumption. Akira, you can come in. I thought she was gonna leave her door open. Why are we knocking? Ah. Sorry. Sorry for calling you over. Um. There's something I've been wanting to talk to you about, so... It's about you and me. I made a promise to help you whenever you were in trouble, for your sake and for mine. But now I... Yeah, you're helping now, it's okay. Yeah, I'm gonna help us fight back. I'm part of the Phantom Thieves, right? I feel the same way as everyone else. I mean, yeah, I don't want to accept this reality. That's all still true, but... I know this isn't real. I figured that out a while ago, but I thought... If I got to see my mom again, then it was okay. I'm so selfish. I was just thinking about what I wanted. You're mad, I know. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. Yeah, we're not mad. Don't lie to me. You're mad at me. You have to be. Well, Why wouldn't you be? I betrayed you. Don't you get that? Uh, sorry. I guess I'm still a little freaked out. This isn't even what I wanted to talk about. There's something else I wanted you to hear anyway. Can I, uh... Is it cool if I say it? Well, yeah, we're here. Um, so, like, Dr. Maruki's reality isn't totally 100% illusion, right? So that means I really did get to see my mom again. She was so nice. Yes. Me too. But I guess I won't get to stay with her. I know, I mean... I know now that this is all in my head. But I wanted to talk with her more. Go on shopping trips and stuff. I don't know, just... I wish I had more time with her. But... But still, like... We can't just live totally dependent on Dr. Maruki's reality, right? Even if I won't get to see my mom anymore... If I can manage to keep working hard and moving forward... Like I was doing in our reality... Then I think she'd be proud of me. <laughs> yeah, thanks. So that's what I'm gonna do. If mom could see that I was working hard, being a part of the group, I think she'd be really happy for me. Yes. I've been thinking really hard lately, wondering how I'd want mom to see me. And I think I figured it out. I want to be someone who keeps looking ahead, someone who never stops improving. This time I'll do what I can to protect you, and everyone else too. So, so let's go um... take back our own reality. The reality where we can beat anything the world throws at us. As long as we have each other. The reality my mom gave me. Yeah. I'm down with that. I still wish that these scenes were voice acted, because they seem very important. But... Whatever. That's like my one big complaint here about the new content, is that... It doesn't seem like too much is voice acted. We've gone from a spaceship to a sphere, kind of back to a spaceship. 
<laughs> but it doesn't look all that bad. All right. Ah, Al Azif. Azif. Thanks. Thanks for listening to all that. I feel a lot better now. Master Futaba has reached full recovery. Get ready for perfect navigation no matter what we're up against. How's what can I say? I'm my mom's daughter. I'll be pestering you a lot more from now on, so sorry in advance and thanks. Can we actually leave the navigating up to Akechi? Infinite scheme, and we have ultimate support. Ah, nice. That actually may be very helpful, and all-out attacks may defeat all foes and fully restore HP to all allies. That's honestly broken as hell, and I will take it. Because I do try to go out for those all-out attacks. Well then. Yeah, fuck the TV program. No, I don't want to work. I really don't. I really, really don't. I think today we're gonna go do more darts. This time it's going to be with a catchy because he's only rank two. So it doesn't really matter how we play this game, we just really gotta play to win with a catchy. That's how I wanna go about this. And then we'll all be ranked up. We'll be we'll be ready to go on that regard. Hey yo, a catchy, what's good? Let's get started. I'm ready on my end. Let's play 701. It'll be more fun that way. I wonder what comments he's going to make while we play. Well, I'm just going to watch for now. All right. I mean, I'll do my best. Yes. I mean, I, I want you to do your best, too. So wait, what's the what's the good one? I can't remember. Where's the... Oh, not that one. Oh, not that. Where's the... Uh, there it is. Okay, so I want that. I want to get the 60s. See, I remember how to play, kind of. Aha! There we go. I see. That was fun. I'll never be able to do that in real life. Hmm. So that's how you play? Wait, you know how I play. We've played before. Well, let's see how he plays. He shouldn't hold back. He shouldn't be lying to us. There we go. That's what I like to see. That's exactly what I like to see. Good shit, my man. Good shit. Three in the... Oh, wow. He got it all in, like, the dead center, too. All right, man. You better focus? Well, of course. I'm very surprised that we're high-fiving, but I guess that's what you gotta do whenever you're doing the uh, baton passes. All right. Back to my shit. Aw, oh, fuck me. Hmm. Yeah, I fucked that up. I'm I'm really good at the game even in this. Well, I was hoping that I'd get a catchy to finish it off, but I don't think that was ever gonna be possible in the first place. Oh wait. I pulled this off without a hitch. Maybe he could finish it? No, no, it's literally impossible. Yeah, he doesn't need my words of good luck, so there will be a round five. I mean, he still gets those bullseyes, man. Which means I still gotta try. No, 86 points. It's not too terrible. I think we'll be okay here. Hey. Take your time. Thank you. <laughs> He's being surprisingly nice here. I wonder if he sees me as a friend. Probably not. Okay, hmm. what do I gotta aim for? One of those yellow marks? Probably get this one since it's uh, the easiest to get. And I fucked up. <laughs> okay. Maybe I'll go for that yellow mark since it should be a lot easier to get. And there we go. I guess I'll take it. Yeah. That finishes it. Zero points. Not a bad result. I see that. And there we go. Everybody's ranked up. <laughs> Man, fuck off. I don't want to. What did you say? Sorry, Morgana. I just really don't want to play with you. Okay, on to a new day. Can we hang out with Sumi? 
Hey. Oh, there's Yusuke. Cold as always, isn't it? But that's part of the winner's charm, I suppose. The air is so pure and crisp. There's a strange clarity to it all. As if everything's suddenly brought into sharper focus, both within and beyond ourselves. <laughs> Can I go to- what the fuck? I wonder. I'm... There's no pressure, but can I see you again later? Just whenever you have time. Thanks, I'm I'll see you later. Day. We gotta hang out... I mean, we've only done Futaba, so... Ryuji, Yusuke, On, Makoto, Haru... <sighs> Maybe Akechi? I don't know. I don't know if he'd want to hang out with us, to be honest. Who can we hang out with today? Sue me, but we aren't ready for that, so I gotta go spend more money to try and get ready for that. Uh, still not enough. Well, that's unfortunate. Well, I guess we can either hang out with On or Yusuke. I guess we'll hang out with Yusuke since he came up to us today. He's not in the underground mall. Sorry, On. I, not you today. It's Yusuke's day today. I just gotta go find his ass. What brings you here? What You, you wanted to talk. Could I have a moment of your time? Something I must tell you if I'm continue to, or if I am to continue onward. Yeah, absolutely. Let's uh, hey, hey. let's talk it out. I'm in your debt. Let's see what's going on in that old noggin of yours. You have my thanks. I know my call was rather sudden. I can only apologize. We've already decided we're going to oppose Doctor Maruki, so I know it's far too late to say anything, but. I just can't keep averting my eyes from the truth. I betrayed you, and all we stand for. How can I pretend I'm still worthy of our lofty ideals or your support? I... I'm an utterly hopeless fool. Now nah, you're just kind of weird, goddamn. Forgive me, let me start from the beginning. Yes. You gave me my strength. You taught me to face the truth without fear. That strength, that anger is how I rose up against Madarame. I saw him for the fraud he was, and I freed myself from his lies. And just look at what I've become. Dr. Maruki gave me a false security. He showed me a life spun from the deepest desires, and fool that I am, I welcomed it. What indescribable humiliation. How could I be such a detestable, narrow-minded sheep of a man? Hey, you need to take a deep breath, brother. I, I cannot. This is no time for calm. And you. You of all people deserve to shame me, and you still say nothing. I betrayed you. I have spat on the very principles of art, and more than that, I have spat on all you did to help me find my answers. I... I'm nothing, not even worth the empty words I spoke. I can't even for I can't even bring myself to look you in the eye. Forgive me, Akira. Such is the human heart. Are our hearts truly so deluded? Are we foolish enough to cling to these misguided fantasies? You offer me mercy I do not deserve. There is no beauty in this. I was a slave to my hubris all along. How did I ever believe the meaning of true beauty was within my grasp? I was just a fool, lost in dreams. Do you mean- Giving up. Akira, I- I can only apologize. You've saved me from repeating my mistakes more than once. Uh, or once more, sorry. Compared to my grand legacy of my mother's art, I am still but a chick toddling in her shadow as she soars. I dreamed of flying at her side. Yet for all my leaps of faith, I only plummeted from my nest again and again. I... What I needed was a teacher. To grasp the beauty of my mother's work, I needed a guiding hand to offer criticism and validation as I earned it. But why was I so convinced that my teacher must be someone in the art world? After all, I have a friend like you. Why are you grabbing me? And our talks together have already led me to many, to so many beautiful revelations. You're gripping kind of hard. My apologies, I got ahead of myself. But my point stands. I believe there is still a great deal I can learn from you. Indeed. And if that's true, then I found my teacher. And with him, the path to truly grasping my mother's art. I will not lose my way again. Let us walk that path together. You should wear that fancy-ass scarf that you found. 
that very unique scarf. See what we get out of this one. Ooh. Now that's fancy. I see. So this power is both my core and my essence. All right. Gorokichi. I like it. Akira, this reality of ideals and perfections. It's not wholly wrong. Truly, there are parts of it I find most almost painfully beautiful. However, you have helped me see clearly again. I believe I wish to return to our own reality. It suits me far better to paint with both ugliness and beauty upon my palette. That's the Yusuke I know. <laughs> ha, indeed. Let us return to our true home, to the reality where I discovered true beauty. Oh no. Hold a moment. Uh, but first. You know what they say about fighting on an empty stomach. That reminds me, I haven't even offered you any tea yet. And you brought some <clears throat> and you brought some kind of treat with you too, didn't you? Is it sweet bean jelly? Or maybe a baked dessert? Like dorayaki? Or perhaps you brought Did we actually bring I'm in something? Your debt. That's news to me. What's this? Increases Holy fuck. Holy shit, that's really big. That's insanely big. Like, sure, this is good. But this. The thing is, is that Sumi kind of handles this now, so I'm okay with getting rid of that. that. That is a high SP count, though. That's really big. Yo. Welcome back. You had a busy uh, end of the year. Make sure you treat your friends well. Oh, I will. Okay, I actually don't know what to do now. Like, sure, we can hang out with confidants. We we can do something. We can hang out with Sojiro. I don't really know what that would entail. I guess there's only one way to find out. I don't have anything else to teach you, but are you going to help out? Eh, I'll decline. Next time, then. Yeah, there's there's really no point in it. I guess to the gym we go. That's how I'll waste my time. Because what else are you supposed to do during the night times? I guess if we hadn't upped our skills all the way, we could do that. Or if we were closer on some confidants. But I really don't want to hang out with Oya. I don't even think we're close enough to max her out. And even if we were, I don't think it's, okay. you know, worth it. Fuck yeah, run that shit. All right. All right. And there we go. We can get something out of going to the gym and I'll take it. Why not? Good morning, Akira. I'm glad I found you. I wanted to speak with you. I just want to talk, that's all. If you have the time, is that okay? Thank, Thank you. you very much. And let's keep moving for now. Well, we've knocked two out of the park so far. We'll keep on grinding. Dude, something is wrong with Ushimaru. What do you mean? I don't know. Something's up. I guess it's not wrong, but he's all different. Anyone know what he's saying? Yeah, who, who is this guy? Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, that's right. The guy that fucking throws chalk at us. Hey, right, me. He's awfully strict, isn't he? Yeah, even the freshmen have, to have heard stories. What exactly is different? His personality? What, he's super nice now? That's just it. He's so nice, it's creepy. And no matter who I ask, they tell me he's always been like this. We got people saying he's basically the school's own Buddha. It does sound as if he's been enlightened, I suppose. So Dr. Maruki's, or Maruki has changed someone's personality. If he really wanted to change, then yes, it's possible. What? Ushimaru, of all people. It's like how I wish to be a Kas Kasumi. I almost said Kasumi. And it's like your own situations, most probably. Something in his past must have been overwritten. And it's also possible his personality just changed, independent of any external events. You figure the real Ushimaru... Uh, went through something bad? 
Maybe he was so nice to everyone, the students took advantage of him and went full delinquent? Ugh, that would be traumatic. Well, we can only speculate all we like. He's the only one who could say for sure what's changed. It's still difficult to understand. So, if it would serve their happiness, even one's personality can change. Yeah, that's... that's not right. Exactly. It's not like I liked him in the first place, but this is freaking weird. I'm getting so mad, I'm gonna go to sleep. Is that even a thing people do when they're mad? Honestly, you could always just pay attention in class. <sighs> that Ushimaru, huh? It's hard to believe. Guess we'll just have to check it out when we're in his class. I'm down, actually. I would like to see it. You know, for myself and all. <sighs> Makoto looked like she uh, I know. Fuck off, I don't want to work. And it's true, you know. I don't know... Actually, yeah, we're not set up for uh, ranking up with Sumi yet, so we gotta keep on doing that shit. I actually don't even know if that's doing anything. I hope it is. It's also, so if it's so cold... Oh, wait. Well, fuck, we can't do that today. Shit, I forgot. Um, If it's raining and it's cold, isn't it supposed to snow? Isn't that how that works? Makoto and Ryuji. I kind of want to hang out with Ryuji personally, you know? Like, sure, Makoto came up to us today, but... You know, Ryuji's the homie. We've gone through so much with him. So, you know, it just makes sense. Actually, let me talk with the, uh... The newspaper gal. People seem to have calmed down about the Phantom Thieves. What do you think about them? Uh... Yeah, they're heroes. I see that their actions had a major influence on you, huh? Well, I want to report the news without being influenced by the public. Honestly, I wish I could interview them in person, but... Huh, that's never gonna happen. Yeah, ha ha ha. Rip. Yo, Akira. You got some time right now? Some time. There's something I need to tell you. Otherwise, I mean... That's just gonna keep weighing me down. Yep, let's, uh... Let's see what his persona's gonna look like. That'll be exciting. He is the homie, though. He is pretty stupid, but he is the homie. What the uh, fuck is this? Really? Really, man? Never mind, I take it all back. Man, how do I say this? Uh, I had a feeling you'd get me. Well, there's something I want to talk about. Since we're bros and all, I figure I'd just invite you over. Uh, my bad, man. I'm sorry. I know I gotta apologize to you. Jeez, that fast? You don't even know what it's about yet. Just listen, okay? I want this apology to mean something, damn it. It's like, you know how things have been for me from the new year to a little while ago? How Dr. Maruki gave me a dream life and I just kind of went with it? <sighs> we basically spent last year together and you supported me through a bunch of personal shit too. I even told you how I'd help whenever you needed it and now, well, even I really, even I know I really let you down. Yeah, but you did help me. Nah, that was a little late. You'd already figured everything out. Knew from the start, right? I mean, sure, I could fight with the rest of the team like nothing's wrong. But I don't know. Feels like that'd be betraying all the stuff we built up together. Either way, I can't just let this go. Gotta, se gotta settle things somehow. So watch this. <laughs> He's gonna do squats? Not gonna stop till you say I can. Can't forgive myself, unless I do this. Can't believe how lame I was. Shitty thing to do. Yep, that's the Ryuji I know. Huh? What the hell's that supposed to mean? Damn it! I can't think and flex at the same time. Yeah, neither can I. Should've figured this would be pointless. I tried to think of something good, but even I know I'm dumb. So hey. I... I really wanted to keep going with the track team. Hoped I could keep it going, maybe get a scholarship, and be a star athlete in college. Make life easier for my mom. And yeah, the Doc's big dream world would have made that happen. But still, I don't know. When I think about it, I realize maybe it isn't that hard a decision. I went through all that bad shit, got wrapped up in hating Kamoshida, turned into some delinquent. I almost got the both of us expelled and started hanging out with An and Mishima more. And even had my big conversation with Nakaoka and Takeishi, even if they beat the crap out of me. Huh. But that's all part of my life now. 
I still own that, you know? It was a real shit show sometimes, but I came out of everything stronger. I'm here because I beat my problems. I can't just pretend they never happened. Wouldn't it be right? You've really matured. <laughs> huh, maybe. And that's why... I'll stick with the reality I fought for. The one where we went through all our shit together. That's where I belong. That was pretty good of Ryuji. Ryuji's been saying some good shit recently. It's very, uh... It's very out of left field. Are we gonna get something that, uh, kind of resembles Captain Kid? I hope. Oh, fuck yeah. Oh, that's tight. <laughs> what the hell, man? Didn't know I still had this much power in me. Not bad. All right. Ah, uh, we're William now. Now that's a mature name. I feel way better now that I finally spilled my guts. Maybe tonight I'll finally get some sleep. It's all you needed? <laughs> yeah, that bro was on a yacht. How's, how's it going, Jamie? Look, you have no idea. When I gotta take a bath knowing I'm not gonna get to sleep in the futon after, that kills me. What? Ah, sorry. Guess I just dragged you over here to listen to me whine. Look, I know sometimes I'm a real pain in the ass, but from now on, I'm gonna run with everything I've got. <laughs> so all you gotta do is count on me, Akira. Alright, what do we get here? Fighting spirit. Next physical attack deals double the damage for all out. That's insanity. That just beats charge out of the water, but that SP count is just insane. I mean, we could do it, like, we can get rid of increase all attack. Nah, we'll get rid of charge. Fuck it. There's a lot of broken ass skills here. I'm gonna need more SP items. Tight. Okay, what can we do to not- Actually, wait, I already know the answer to that. Absolutely nothing. Um... Shoot. You know, I've made a- Let me get these guys out of here. Please, just leave. Okay, thank you. I don't know what that conversation was about. I don't care. You got 15 minutes left for your break? How's your, uh, how's your shift going? Also, here's my- here's my predicament. I don't know if I've just used the curry before, but I'm sure I've made curry, right? Yeah. I've made this curry, but I can't use it in a fight, I've noticed. Unless I'm just straight up missing it. I don't understand that. And that's why I've only been making the master coffee. Come on. We'll have Kawakami do it. Make sure you close up. And then we're going to the gym. Because that's, that's literally all I got going for me here. I don't want to hang out with the confidants. I'm sorry. I feel like this is just the better use of time. I could be wrong. I could be very wrong, too. You got a fucking tiny piece of Pringle stuck in your phone charger? Really? Oh, dude. That's ass. I'm so sorry. Yeah, I know. You're poor. I, that's what I that's what I assumed. Looking good. So this equipment Oh no, the bench press. Alright, let's see how this works out for us. I mean, I remember starting out with the bench press when I went to the gym. That shit hurt. It didn't hurt that much. I wasn't that dead. Alright. Alright. Wanna head back? Let's get the fuck out of here. I know I could be doing this with the protein, but you know, who cares? I wish Kawakami would come over and not look like that. That'd, uh, that'd make life a little easier. Sounds good, Jamie. That seems like a good idea. Good morning. Hey, Akira-kun. Might I borrow you for a bit? I think we need to talk. Can you come to the roof after school? You'll find out soon enough. Only joking. It's nothing terribly important, really. No, 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 this, it's life-changing. It's, no, it's seriously important. Go? All we've done in this session, by the way, Jamie, is just hang out with confidants. Go to the temple well, for more SP. Gotcha. 
Have you all heard? The economy is apparently doing pretty well this year. Because of that, I tried getting into the stock market. Not a thing you want to jump into with no experience. I lost five months of my allowance in one fell swoop. It wasn't a huge loss, so it's not that bad, but... And it's quite a thing to stare your failure in the face. My portfolio looked awful. Oh, yes. Speaking of things being awful, I use that word because my portfolio looked absolutely terrible, but awful originally meant something else. All right, what's the question? What, is the what did the word awful originally mean? Excellent, impressive, baffling. Impressive, really? This is oh, it. I guess because it can be used Correct. in like... And like, you know, saying awfully good. Ahem. Sick. Oh yeah, the economy is, uh, economy's not gonna do good this year. It wasn't really good that last year. We're fucked, man. That's all I gotta say. Oh yeah. I'm an impressive guy. Awe-inspiring. Thanks, brother. Thanks. I, I like that you said that, my cat. What do we do today? Mm. Okay, we still gotta hang out with Haru, On, and Makoto. Right? Those are the last three. Can't hang out with fucking soup. God damn it. Time to go waste my money. Okay, can we hang out with her? Yes. Yes. Fuck everybody else. This is the only person that matters. Let us hang out. What? Yes, I know. We. I you, see. Yeehaw. 